So, I've been using Tableau for almost 10 years. I've seen a lot of changes and new features, but honestly, none of them was as exciting as this extension. With this extension, you no longer need data identification, you no longer need templates, or even just a simple calculation to make a complex chart. This extension is the game changer that I, and probably you too, were expecting to make complex visualization in Tableau without any workaround. With this video, I'm going to show you everything you need to know about this extension. First, I'm going to show you how easy it is to use a Viz extension and how you can add them to your worksheet. Then we will explore some of the advanced formatting options. And finally, we will answer some of the recurring question. Is it safe? How does it work? And is there any limitation? Okay, now let's open Tableau and let's get started. So for this demo, I'm going to select the sample Superstore data source. This extension works with any kind of data source, so it's just for the demo. Now if I click on Marks and I, I see this extension, and I already have my polar area chart. Let's click on it. This is already the first advantage of this extension, is that we created a getting started page with pre-rendered chart and a quick tutorial that explains you how to use the chart. Now, if you look, there is an even more important change. Uh, you can see that the marks count, you see spokes, values, target. Those are not uh, your everyday marks count, right? These are specific marks count for the polar area chart, and each of these extension will have their own. Okay, so let's put a subcategory in spokes and sales in values. And look at that. In only two drag and drop, I already created a complex visualization in Tableau. But that's not it. So if I over over the section, you can see the tooltip and I can click and exclude some values. I can put categories in color or segment. I can put categories and filter and select the different categories. I can also right click on subcategories and sort them by sales. So as you can see, it does really look and feel like Tableau. It is Tableau, we are inside Tableau. How was that? Pretty cool, right? No data identification, no calculation, no templates, just pure Tableau drag and drop. Today, making advanced visualization in Tableau is as easy as making a bar chart or a line chart. But let me show you how this extension reacts in a dashboard. So now I'm going to create a second worksheet and I'm going to show the sales by manufacturer with a simple bar chart. So now I'm going to make a dashboard, put my polar area chart on the left and my bar chart on the right. If I decide to use this chart as the filter, I can click on the different manufacturer and it will filter my polar area chart. But I can also use the polar area chart as a filter and click on the individual segment of the polar area chart and it also filter my other chart. All of these extensions are that easy to use and in a minute, I'm going to show you some advanced formatting options. But first I need to explain you how you can add these extensions in your worksheet. Directly in your worksheet, go to the marks count and click this button, add extension. At this point, you have two options. You can directly use one of the extension on the right. Those are published on the Tableau exchange. They are published either by Tableau or by trusted partner like us. Usually the extension on the exchange are free versions, but more importantly, they have been tested and approved by Tableau. You can also use a local Viz extension if you have purchased one or if you have developed your own. When you want to use a local Viz extension, you need to select a T-Rex file. And I will explain later what is a T-Rex file. Uh, and if you're going to use a local T-Rex file, just make sure that you know and trust the developer. To continue the demo, let's go ahead and click on our tree diagram on the exchange. You will see some example, a description, and a button to open the extension. Let's click on it. And finally, you have this window to ask you to allow the Viz extension to run, and you can see who made it, and that the Viz extension doesn't have access to all your data. And just like that, we added a tree diagram into our worksheet, and now it's just about drag and drop, and you can make uh, your tree diagram. At the moment that I'm recording this video, we have 12 Viz extensions available, but we will continue to add more and more. Okay, we've covered the basics, so now let me show you how you can configure and format your Viz extension. So let's start with our tree diagram. So I'm going to put category in detail, subcategories in detail, and sales in size. So we already have a, a first tree diagram that already looks good, but now I'm going to show you how you can format this Viz extension and add a lot of more options. So let's click this format extension button, and this opens a brand new window that we have developed where you can find a lot of different configuration options. So for example, you can rotate your tree, uh, you can also maybe change the layout to a horizontal tree. Uh, what about adding a root to your tree and call that root total sales? You could also change the size of your different nodes, change the padding, 
change the opacity, change the width of the lines, and many, many other things. You can also click on color, so we have different uh, menu, different tabs. You can color uh, your tree by categories. And here you have access to already existing palettes, so for example, observable 10. But you can also click on individual columns and maybe add the root in gray. You can also click on label and change the font style, the font color, the font size and everything. So this format option exists in every Viz extension and you will see that we added different configuration options depending on the Viz extension that you are using. I'm going to create a playlist where I will explain each Viz extension in detail and how you can use the tree, the radar, the polar and all of our different Viz extension in detail. So that's pretty much everything you need to know about how to add and use our Viz extension. Now let me address some of the frequently asked questions that you probably have also. Are Viz extensions safe? If you are using these extensions built by Tableau or by trusted partners, yes, they are safe. These extensions don't access the raw data and only have access to the aggregated data that you drag and drop in the worksheet. And even then, the Viz extension only reads the data, but it is never stored anywhere. For those who cannot use any cloud technology, you can also host our Viz extension directly on-premise, completely disconnected from the internet. How does it work? Viz extension is really two things, a T-Rex file and a web page. The TRX file is basically just a manifest that tells Tableau where to find the web page containing the extension's functionality and a different encoding. Those are the different marks cards that you will find when you use a Viz extension. So for example, here you can see we have the spokes, you have the values, the target, and the color. Each encoding can have its own icon. You can specify the role and the type. So there's discrete or continuous dimension or measure. And you can also specify the maximum amount of fields that can be put on that card. The web page uses the Viz extension API to read the aggregated data and render the visualization inside your worksheet. Are there any limitations? Currently, there is a few limitations. For example, you cannot use the rows or columns shelves in, in Tableau. And also, if you try to export a Viz extension, it will always render as blank uh, if you export it as an image or a PDF. These are all known issues with Viz extension and they appear in all Viz extension, even those created by Tableau. Uh, and we hope that they will be resolved in the future. If you have more questions, we also added a FAQ that you will find in the description. For the moment, I'm really inviting you to open Tableau uh, go to our worksheet and try the different Viz extension to see how they look, how they feel and how they can fit your need. Thanks a lot for watching and have a great day.